Hello everyone, this is Ashley from Crafting with Ashley and welcome to this video. This is the little project we're making today. It's a magnetic bookmark. Isn't it cute? I just love this little Santa. So let me show you. Let's make another one together, I should rather say. This is the stamp set. I'm using Be Jolly. And I used this Santa before and I'm going to use this one now. I'm going to stamp a memento ink so I can colour in using the stamp and blend alcohol markers. So I ink up my stamp set and I've just got a piece here of basic white, some scrap. Nice big piece of scrap actually. And there we go. There's our little fella. So I'm going to colour in. And I must have put you on fast forward while I'm colouring, but I'll just tell you what colours I'm going to use. Basic black, real red and cherry cobbler, ivory, and then daffodil delight. So I'll, I'll just zoom you in a little bit so you can see maybe a bit better. And I'm going to start colouring and I'll see you at the end. So I coloured our little Father Christmas in and then I just fussy cut him out. So that's what we have so far. Isn't he cute? Whoopsie daisy, I'm throwing him everywhere. Now I have here a piece of real red cardstock that measures just under two inches by eight and a quarter inches. I'm just going to firstly use this. This is the delightful tag topper punch and we're going to punch our top and bottom just like that and let's put the other side in okay, keep it straight and punch and there we go close up our punch get rid of all these bits here so that's what we have now you can either score this I'm just going to be lazy and do this the off easy way. I'm just going to fold it in half so that my two pieces match and then use my bone folder here to get a really nice fold just like that. So open it out and I'm going to put my Santa Claus or Father Christmas depending on what you call him on one side. So I'm going to use a bit of Tombow Come on, Tombo. Okay. And then we are just going to line him up something like that. And I can see I've got a little bit of overhang. And you can chop that off if you want. I'm just going to leave it. Now I'm going to put my magnet in place. Now these are just paired magnets. And I've got these off the internet yonks ago. A couple of years ago must be now. And I've been using them up. So I'm going to peel off one piece. And stick it down. Like that. Put my other one over the top. Peel this off push it down and press and there we have our little magnet okay now finishing touches I'm going to use some of these sequins here 
and I just put a few in the lid and I'm just going to get my take your pick tool here it is and then I'm just going to get some Tombow and I'm going to put this in three places I like things in odd numbers that will do and we're just going to put a few sequins and this was just because I felt otherwise the background looked just a little bit too plain I'm just going to use these whiter ones here ah, wants to stick to me more than anything else not unusual okay and one more down here just like that just put those back in the lid in the base roller and there we have a little bookmark and there we have our other ones we have a matching pair isn't that cute so i hope you like the project if you did i'd be grateful if you could give it a thumbs up so youtube now and please don't forget to subscribe to future videos if you want more information about this project supply list and um, measurements etc it's all on the blog post on my website and the links to that and all my social media links are in the description box below so thank you again and until next time enjoy being creative bye bye